shook it up. Good morning, guys, and welcome back to Lainey's channel. I'm just up. Well, no, I'm actually up hours now. What time is it? Yeah, I'm up a couple of hours. I usually get up about 8 a.m. Um, because I don't have a 9 to 5 job, so I don't have to be up earlier. Yesterday, however, I woke at like 5.30. 5.30? When did I become American? Um, yeah, I woke up at 5.30. Um, half five for all the Irish people out there. And I just couldn't get back to sleep. And um, yeah, I kind of go through phases of either sleeping way too much. Um, like as in I could like sleep like a bear for like 20 hours. Or um, having a slight insomnia where I wake super early in the morning. So I'm kind of going through that right now. Like I was awake much earlier than eight, but my alarm goes off at eight. So I got up at eight. Um, but yeah. I'm back on the YouTube. Back. Lucy's here, Roxy's here, Bailey's here. Um, I don't really know what to talk about most of the time. That's why I'm like, my life is so boring. And I went on and checked my comments and someone just said, yay, you're back. And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna whip out the camera and record myself, even though I've got a spot on my face and I'm due to have a shower now. And I was watching Below Deck because if you're not watching Below Deck, what's wrong with your life? Um, so yeah I thought I'd whip out the camera I'm not even going to train today because I've got a bit of a cold and um, that's my excuse what's yours um, but I've trained already three times this week and they've been good sessions and um, I've started jiu-jitsu this year so that's a whole other story while in LA um, before Christmas um, I made friends with a guy and he was saying that um, I should do jiu-jitsu um, so I just set it as my New Year's resolution. Only thing is, like, I'm really enjoying it, number one, but I don't have the passion for it that I have, like, for weight training. Like, I don't feel this, like, need to go and um, go and do jiu-jitsu, which normally puts me off, but I've made myself this task for the New Year or whatever, resolution, and I am trying to go as much as possible. Um, I have some of the skill points like I'm flexible I'm fit um and uh, you know I'm quite a determined person but my mind sorry I've got like a really itchy eye because I've got like a little like sty in my eye so I keep on rubbing it which I know I shouldn't but um yeah it's like inside my eyelid anyway I digress um yeah so jujitsu um yeah I'm like I have the ability to be good at it but then I'm not very good at focusing uh, my brain for long periods of time if I'm not super interested in something so if I get distracted I kind of forget what I'm doing and then I have to like kind of reset um, and I'm not very keen on um, you know tactile contact with people so there's only one other girl in my class and uh, she's like same height and build as me, which is amazing. But when she doesn't go, I don't want to go because I don't want to roll with the guys. I don't want to like be wrestling with the guys. I'm just not, I, it just makes me uncomfortable and I don't like to be feeling uncomfortable. So yeah, there are a few aspects that are holding me back from my progress with Jiu Jitsu. Um, uh, I'm doing it at Dam Strong Gym in Shrewsbury and um, they're quite new but um, yeah if you're in the Shrewsbury Shropshire area check it out they have an outdoor gym they do the jiu-jitsu and um, yeah I'll, I'll, I'll try and link it down below or something if you're in my area and are interested in starting jiu-jitsu or you know a new martial art oh here's Lucy hi Luce so I'm going to go and have a shower now and then I'll update you more on what's going on in my life. Um, yeah. Out of the shower and this is kind of like my routine most days. Um, today's hair wash day so it'll take me a bit longer to get ready. But I've moisturised my 40 year old face. Oh my god I'm nearly 41. 41! I don't look too shit, do I? Well, part of it is thanks to this. I have it out because I'm due for my top up. So this is Profilo. It's like a skin um, kind of booster. It boosts your uh, collagen and your elastin. I do it every six months. Um, I can do it on myself. I can do it on other people. So if you're interested, it's a bit pricey, but worth it. Worth it. Keeps you young. So mine is wearing off right now. 
but it's for your lower face and it kind of plumps everything out and gets rid of all those fine lines. So I'm going to do that in the next couple of days. Right now I'm eating peanut butter on wholemeal toast with some honey and coffee number two. I've cut back on my coffee significantly. The dogs are all with me. I'm in my little dressing room. Um, because everyone should have an area where they prep themselves for the day if you are uh, blessed enough to have the space. So I usually kind of, even in a small space, make an area where I can like get myself organized, as in the face. But yeah, um, I'm back off to uh, the States again in less than three weeks now. Yeah, two and a half weeks. So I'm going to Orlando. I'm helping my friend um, at an event that she is running um, with L'Oreal and Redkin. So that's pretty exciting. I've got five days there and then I am flying to California again to um, see some friends, some male, some female. Oh, wouldn't you love to know the insights into Lainey's exciting dating life? Honestly, it's not that exciting. I've realised that I don't really enjoy the whole dating part of it, but apparently you can't skip it. You have to date people before you marry them. But, um, yeah, I enjoy meeting new people, but it's the whole thing of having to, like, act normal for a certain amount of time. <laughs> But no, I, I am enjoying meeting new people and um, making new friends. Um, I don't think any of them have dumped me as a friend yet, so. It's all good. All good in the hood. Um, I'm going to continue getting ready. I need to go and get these nails fixed. I've had to cut them down because of Jiu Jitsu. But before I go back to the States, I'm getting my claws back because I like having them long because I look like I've got like little mini child hands with tattoos. <laughs> My friend Amelia is coming later. We're going to go and have some drinks and probably some pizza in Shrewsbury. So I've just finished getting myself ready. Ooh. Just blow dried my hair. Get some daytime makeup. Have a docking, a docking bag. I was going to say a barking dog. Roxy and um, I'm just in a bikini because it's slightly less offensive to people than me and my underwear so um, right now I've been trying to cut a little bit of fat from when I went to um, LA uh, because I eat really well over there because I've got people cooking for me going out for meals and stuff so um, yeah this is me right now I know I'm not fat none of us are fat let's just put it out there our fat cells expand and retract depending on how much energy they are storing in them so if you deplete your calories through exercise or dieting you're going to like shrink down those fat cells they don't disappear they don't turn into muscle they're two separate entities let's just get that straight there's muscle and there's fat your muscle can get bigger and get smaller your fat can get bigger and get smaller okay got that all clear so right now I'm trying to shrink down the fat cells a bit just to make it a little bit more svelte feel a bit more confident make sure that all my clothes fit that's what I care about right now I don't care about what I weigh what does it matter so that's the butt I want to build up some more muscles so I want to grow these little babies on my arms because I like having muscly arms for a little person. And then, you know, you can't target the fat loss, but mine kind of comes off around the middle and around my upper body. So, um, yeah, I've got a little bit of a pooch, but I'm 41, nearly. And that's what happens when women get older, we store more fat around here. It's just from the belly button down, we store more fat. This, normal. When we get swollen down here, Normal, we've got organs down here. We've got all those baby making organs. So don't worry if you got a little bit of a bump, 
the weird thing is when you don't because it's always there look I have a small waist but I got that it's okay some people's have the bigger fat cells some people have the smaller fat cells it's okay it's okay okay so muscles in the back looking good the butt looking good we still have some cellulite and some jiggle wiggle it's all good it's all good i have been in town for the day um getting my nails done again i said short I'm not really into the short nails i prefer them long but and i've got spot cream on my zit so this is real life we don't all look perfect all the time um, it was raining, so put a hat on. Got to curl my hair. Just let the dogs out because they've had their dinner, and um, it's a bit rainy, so I'm not going to walk them today because it's going to be really super mucky. But I'm going to bring them on a super long walk tomorrow. So they're just out in the garden. I can hear Roxy barking, demanding to be brought in. Um, but yeah, just went into town, got my nails done, had a glass of um, wine. Cause that's my little ritual i get my nails done and have a cocktail or a glass of wine and come home um do that once every two weeks not the most exciting day but we're going to be real here aren't we because life isn't all fucking sunshine and rainbows me up my got this new lip balm from beauty bay and new spot cream obviously <laughs> it's nice a natural look but yeah my friend Amelia is on the train from London to come and stay with me so I'm gonna get um, a taxi into town because you know don't drink and drive um, and um, yeah gonna have a few drinks get some pizza have some fun I'll show you what I wear I'm gonna curl the hair make it curly make it big because right now it's straight and flat maybe top up the makeup a bit rub off the spot cream <laughs> life with Lainey maybe I'll bag myself a date tonight probably not you never know Monday, the 27th, second last day in February. February has absolutely flown by. What are you doing, Luce? So I've just gotten groceries delivered and I just thought I'd show you what I order when it's just me. Because it's completely different. I used to have to facilitate someone else and their needs and their wants and now it's just me. So um, it's obviously a lot less. And I don't shop quite so frequently either. Like once every two weeks or so. I do like a big grocery shop. Um, sorry, I'm all sleepy. I've had like a long weekend of having friends here. But um, yeah, I try and drink a lot of water. Um, I know it's not the best for the environment, but I do recycle all my bottles. But um, I just feel like it encourages me to drink if I have bottled water. And then I have some flavored sparkling water. I got into these in um, the US because they all drink them out there and it's probably better than having Pepsis all the time and I really like this one. There is some carbs in it so like obviously the other ones are just sparkling water but these have like, ugh, like per can I think it's like 10 grams of carbs. Not bad and they're nice, they're sweet, they really have a nice proper cherry flavour. I love my cereal so I've just topped up all my cereal. I'm not going to get through all this cereal in like a week but um, yeah, generic store brand crunchy the cornflakes, um, like a muesli kind of one and because I'm a big child I have um, a chocolatey one as well so got my chocolate hoops as well. <laughs> A lot of times I'll mix them all together. I call it cereal surprise. But my hair really needs to be washed, so excuse the hair. Um, but yeah, for health, I like walnuts because they're um, really good for you. Uh, they're good for your, um, I think they have like iodine in it, so they're good for your thyroid. Cranberries, because I like cranberries. And then I add them and make overnight oats with like yogurt and um, leave it overnight. And then I've got 
some gut healthy activity yeah. yogurts um yogurts yogurts um ginger nuts are not for me they're for the dogs um i facilitate them i also have loads of these mackerel fillets so i get these for roxy roxy what age are you now roxy's 10 now and um she gets sore joints at the front so for the omegas for her joints we add some of the mackerel and she can be a bit of a fussy pot with her food so that helps that i've got some ham for sandwiches and some cheese this is the eat lean cheese which i love high protein and it's lactose free because i'm not the best with lactose uh, just for when I'm running out the doors of the gym, I like to have like snacks like popcorn and things like that so that I have something to eat on my way. Got some health as well, some apples, some bananas. Um, these are my hobnobs or my OT biscuits that I have one every morning. Got some tomatoes, little sweet ones. I usually use the tomatoes for making guacamole, so I got my... But I have the other ingredients there, like onions and everything, so I don't need to top everything up. I um, haven't had mushrooms in ages, so I'll probably make some kind of a uh, pasta dish later with some mushrooms. Because um, previously I wasn't allowed to have mushrooms because someone didn't like them. But now we don't have to facilitate other people's wants or needs. Um, we have chocolate Philadelphia, which is nice on rice cakes or on toast. Um, got some low fat sausages. I'm not really a fan of fatty sausages, not because of the fat content, I just don't like the grizzly bits. So these ones are lean, so they don't have all the grizzly bits. And then I've got some chicken, so I've got my milk for my coffee, um, this is the one I like, and i just got two to keep me going, so I'm going away in two weeks, so that'll keep me going until I go away. And then I've got some lacto-free milk for my cereal some chocolate chips and then um, for my Nespresso machine I've got some Nespresso pods and um, I also have my proper coffee machine that I use in the morning but yeah that's it that's what I have every morning every morning what am I saying I'm not even awake guys uh, but yeah hope you enjoyed that and um, yeah in the mornings I actually do have my coffee and I add in some collagen because I spend my time flying high, going round, but I'm always getting wayside. Some people trying to shit on me. I said, Girl, you can sit on me. Cause bitch, they be hating.